Coach, the, you know, you talked about in the cold, the, the playing defense is the, the hardest thing to do. A uh, little bit, maybe a lapse of focuses here and there that, that caused a few uh, runners to get in scoring position, set up a few of their scoring plays. Uh, yeah, well, well, they scored the one on the, yeah, certainly the two out error by uh, Kaler, uh, and that's a legit error. The other one I'm not sure is in play, he you know, probably can make most days, didn't hit his gloves, so I don't think that's an error. But, um, and then, yeah, we had a chance to make a play in right field and didn't do that. But I thought, you know, I mean, it was pretty evenly played ball game. The quality of our at-bats in the first half of the game, I thought were really good. Um, Rock smoked the ball to center field that hung up in the air. We had first and third one out and our best hitter up, and he smokes the ball at the second baseman for a double play. That's, you know, that's, that's the tough part of baseball. And back half of the game, obviously, our at-bats were very poor, and you have to um, give a lot of credit to that lefty. Uh, he did a nice job. Struck out, he struck us out eight times out of the bullpen. So, for their first game of the year to come down here and do that, you have to tip your cap to them. So, I thought we pitched well. Um, I thought we caught the baseball on a cold day. Great. Uh, you know, if we get a few more timely hits, you don't even remember, you know, those those misplays. But when you when you don't, when you, you know, there's three things can happen in a game: you pitch, play defense, get timely hits. And I thought for the most part we pitched and played. You know, we had two errors, but. You know, for the most part, we played good defense on a, on a tough day, uh, but we didn't get a timely hit. If you do all three of those things, you win every time. If you do two of the three, you win most of the time. But this is the day that we didn't. I'd like to see a little bit of a change of approach with the guy throwing a little bit more off-speed stuff there to the pin. Yeah, I mean, there's no doubt. you got to recognize what's, what's going on ahead of you. And uh, you got to understand what he's trying to do. It's way easier said than done, no doubt about it. You know, it's e the game's real easy from the press box, and the game's real easy from the dugout. The game's not easy in the batter's box, but um, you know we had an opportunity there to put a ball in play, potentially score a run, and it just didn't happen. Coach, you look at the Eagle got two, uh, two got two plays where they had runners in scoring position. Just what does that say about his confidence? Who, who now? Uh, uh, Detmer. What about him now? He worked out at two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, he just executed pitches. I thought he did. Got his breaking ball going. I thought he got better as the game went on. Um, you know, they, they, did, they, they swung the bat well against them. They're, specifically, the right-handers swung, swung the bat well against them. So, uh, he'll, you know, but, but, but he, did, you know, he gave us a chance to win the ball game. Uh, and Palace did what we needed him to do, and Hogan was outstanding. So, uh, you know, if, if we get that every day, we, we'll be fine. Good to see Nathan's uh, changeup working a little bit better. He said he felt like he had a little bit better. Yeah, he threw, he, he threw a couple more of those to, that, today that were pretty good. Uh, fastball command wasn't great. Ball kept running back over the middle of the plate to his arm side. And that's against those right-handed hitters. Those balls get hit down the left field line. Um, but again, give credit to, to Penn. You know, come out of the, come out of the. Well, I can't say come out of the cold weather. They came out of warm weather and came to cold weather. But, uh, but yeah, that's you know they they deserve to win the ball game. Trevor Warner not playing for the second consecutive game. Uh, what's his status? Like? He's close. Uh, you know, we just we can't risk long term. So. Um, you know, will he play this weekend? Potentially. Uh, is he most likely to play Tuesday? Yes. But uh, I just want to be 100% sure. And he hasn't swung a bat yet. He played catch today. He moved around a lot today, but he hasn't swung a bat yet. So obliques are really scary things. Those things can last for weeks. And, uh, and we certainly don't want that with him. Coach, uh, first loss on your time here at College Station. Just how do you build off this? And what do you say to the guys post game to get them ready for tomorrow? Just same thing I just said to you guys. You know, we didn't deserve to win, and uh, that's going to happen in baseball. I don't. You know, we understand that it happens. Freaking, believe me, I'm sick to my stomach, and, and uh, we'll we'll continue to be till we get to play again. Hopefully, we get to, the weather allows us to play tomorrow. But um, but yeah, I mean, it's this is it's way more about how we respond to this than it is what happened today.